<laughs> right, we've, we've had a little bit of a change of plan, haven't we? We have, yeah. yeah and it's, I'll blame the fridge. Yeah, but I think the fridge has made some good decisions where we're going. Yeah, because the, yeah. the, the fridge is still not working. Um, we're, we're hoping to get someone to come out to us. Um, Bailey are trying to arrange a Dometic engineer to come out, but so far they haven't had any engineers. But they did say that we could stop off at their offices and uh, someone might be able to have a look at it. It might be something simple, a wire falling off or something, but I don't want to get inside the fridge and no. start pulling wires about, basically. No, no, no. So we're going to go to Wareham, aren't we? Yeah, uh, this Wareham is here. Hang on, let's just zoom in a bit. Yeah, so Wareham's there. It's yep. not far from Paul. Yeah. Um, it's a site called Hunter's Moon. Yeah. Um, we heard good reports about it so yeah. um, there's lots to, to do in the area that's what sort of attracted me yeah i mean uh, apparently the blue pool is very nice yeah. you've got uh, corf castle there yeah and the national trust village you've got the swanage heritage railway yeah running through it yeah and it's the isle of purbeck and also because you've got the jurassic coast yeah so it's a really nice area to yeah. go to i think the the reason the reason we were going to um, I've got the name of it now. Putt's Corner. <laughs> Putt's Corner. So it's gone completely out of <laughs> yeah. your memory now. <laughs> been erased. <laughs> Was that we were originally planning to go to Cornwall. That's right. We didn't yeah. go to Cornwall so we could meet yeah. up with Oliver, Oliver Cox, Cox yesterday. Yes, which we did yesterday. And I think after this bit of footage I'll, I'll play a little bit of footage about that. Um, so we were going to go Cornwall down to Devon. Yeah. Then we were going to go across the New Forest. Yeah. Then I started thinking well it's better if we get nearer the new forest in one way, nearer where perhaps we can get the fridge sorted. Hopefully. Yeah. Yeah. So and if we don't get the fridge sorted, it'd be wine. It'd be red wine and um, and but warm I'm butter. Asking, <laughs> and asking someone else if we can, can we borrow uh, their fridge. Put something in their fridge. So yeah. If anyone who's going to Herman Fest is watching, we might need to borrow bits of your fridge. fridge yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Never mind. Never, Never mind. mind. All, no, part, all else, part of the adventure. Everything else is fine, isn't yeah. it? It's, yeah. it's just the fridge on gas. That's it. That's it. Yeah, I thought we were having a great time. Yeah, no, we are enjoying the van. It's, it's been good. Yeah, so um, we're going to go and empty water, fill up, and empty set bins. Off. Yeah. yeah, and off we go. Yeah. Just wanted to mention a door. It's quite yeah, it's quite interesting. I mean, it, the, the bathroom, we I think we've mentioned it, is quite small, isn't it? So if you're at the at the sink and you're washing your face, you end up with your you end up with your bottom sticking <laughs> out into the gangway. Yeah. So you the, what they've done is they've made it so that the door opens all the way out. So you've got a lot more space in the bathroom. Yeah, and I was saying it's a bit like the 75 too, the autograph. That had a slidey door, didn't it? Yeah. And some, and although that that wasn't ideal because it, it was kind of stiff and kept yeah. coming off the runners, um, it did make you feel as if, well, when you're in the bathroom, there is a bit more space. Yeah. They were just by accident. Yeah, we didn't really realise it went it went all the way back. No, no. Sorry. Yeah, and there's no straps on it. I mean, often you have straps. To stop it going all the way back but no it's quite a good design feature yeah it's one of those silly things that you think oh that's clever yeah 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 these are cleverer too as well but <laughs> they, get it, they get a little bit in the way sometimes of the seat don't they yeah you yeah. sit back on you pull on the lead so yeah, really so ought to really unplug you that, when you're, you're not no, using it moment, no. No. so should we well, i think we better get going i think we better get going empty the water empty the toilet empty the rubbish We've emptied the poppy. Yeah, she's ready she's, to go. she's in a, a driving position. Yeah. So we'll catch her later. All right. Hello, Poppy. Who have we got with us? Well, you're not that bothered, are you? <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Look who we got. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Oliver with us, and uh, Oliver's popped over, so we can have a little chat. Yeah, uh, it's part of our meetup tour, I guess, isn't it? So, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, we're going to do a little bit to the camera, and I guess the thing we really want to do is say, go and have a look at Oliver's channel. It's caravanning with the Coxes. I suppect there'll be a link up somewhere, somewhere up here. Up here. <laughs> yeah. I think it's normally over that way, over there somewhere. <laughs> so um, yeah, so have a look at Oliver's uh, channel, and you'll see this video, our, our little chat. We're going to have a, a chat about the differences between motorhoming 
and caravanning. Hmm. Which should be interesting because, as you can see, we're in a motorhome. Yeah, <laughs> <Yes. laughs> and uh, yeah, Oliver, you're staying at the Exbridge site. Exbridge Lakeside, yeah. yeah just up the that's road. right, just up the road. So we thought we'd meet up. Oliver's bought all his gear. And uh, Poppy's just going to have a snooze <laughs> whilst yeah. Poppy's going on. <laughs> so let's get started. Why not? Signposted Wareham, and it says yeah. site entrance on the right within 3.5 miles. Okay, so it's a little way down here. Then. Yeah. Okay. I see in the middle of the road. It's a wide load. Oh God. Static caravan. <laughs> yeah, at least we got the fridge fixed. I'll tell you a little bit more about that later. And we're on our way to the campsite in a couple of miles, I think. Yeah. <coughs> reminds me a bit of the new forest. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? It's Wareham Forest, isn't it? Oh, is it? Yeah. Is this it? Wareham Forest it's Tourist Park. Park. No, it's no, not. That's not it. No. So that's on the left anyway. Another campsite there. It's a CL there, it's all else yeah. fails. That's Birchwood Tourist Park. This is Cold Harbour and it's got to be somewhere up here. Yeah. That's the address. Oh, there's another sign coming up. This is it, on the right. Oh yeah, I see it now. Gypsy caravan then. A proper Romany caravan. They beat me too, haven't they? Oh, they're going in there. Well, I thought they were going in there. It was signalling, wasn't it? Yeah, it was signalling left. That's us. Yeah.
Yeah. around to the right here it's still okay isn't it yeah that's pitch 13 dog's not on a lead yeah I think someone's just gone on 17 yeah I think yeah Twenty, which is there, or those twenty-four, twenty-five, which are further back. Yep. Right here, out here. Right. Yeah. Glad to be out of the van, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> Glad to be here, I should say. Yeah, I know. It's a long journey. Right, it's going to let them know where we are. This site's actually got three toilet blocks. <laughs> <laughs> this must be quite a big site. Yeah, I can't remember how many. I think it was 150 at least. Yeah. I'm trying to remember where the reception is now. It's over that way. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Get lost here. Yeah. Dishwashing area and toilet there. Information point. It's even Danger an old 415 volts. As well. 415 volts if you want to get electrocuted. There's an old Tito phone box there that doesn't appear to be working. Information hut. Looks like there's lots to do around here. We'll have a look at that later. Right, Pops? You found the dog walk, yeah? No, I found the dog area, didn't we? Well, there's a, there's a walk through over there, if you want to go down there. Alright, okay. Walk this way with the dog. Please keep your dog on a lead. Yes. You don't have to walk that way, but. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, as soon as I switch the camera on, you know what she's going to do, don't you? Just down there sniffing. Oh, right, no, that's not what I was thinking. <laughs> Poppy! Go on, pups! No, not no. Smell. another smell. Puppy pups, Dad! Come on, pups! Good girl! <laughs> We've got no smidge on at the moment. No, no, not wearing our smidge. And to be honest, if, if we'd been wearing it, what was it? Well, the day we were at Linmouth, what day was that? Was it when we went into L L Glen Lynn yeah. Gorge? Yeah. Because you got bitten, didn't you? Sunday it was. Yeah. Nobody wants to see my horrible bites. Yeah, I want to see them. <sighs> oh yeah. And there, that's the work. That's burst that one. Yeah, it, it just yeah. burst that one. Yeah. So we should have been wearing our smidge. Yeah. All the time we were in Scotland, we got weren't one bothered bite. at all. No. no. As soon as we come down. Down here. Down here. It wasn't, it was horse fly, I think, didn't we? I think it was, well, there were loads of flies sort of buzzing around as well yeah. at the top there. And yeah. I couldn't get away from them. I couldn't walk fast enough to get away. It was a trouble. Yeah. Come on, pups. Come on, then. Come on. Luckily, no, none of them are a bit poppy. Well, she poppy doesn't seem to get bothered, does she? No, she's got a protector on anyway. Here. So it's obviously the visitors car part of this bit, oh, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's a tent area there. Yeah. Okay. So is that an extra? I don't know. Area? I don't know. So it's, oh, it's a biodiversity area. 
And basically they let the grass grow, grow didn't they? Yeah. Uh, well, I suppose it encourages bees and things. And keep your dog on a lead there. Well, so you can yeah. walk around there. That's quite nice. Yeah. 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 Dog's paradise. Yeah. Yep. Someone's got a tent. Yep. Got a big tent. Oh, Go on, Pops, we'll go get set up now. Hey. Okay. Could be in any toilet on a caravan or motown club site. You know, there's a small shop, does milk, chews eggs, bacon, crisps, TV cables, loo chemicals, usual sort of thing. Dishwashing. Yeah. The oh. laundry, you might be using this later. Yeah, you might be using this at some point. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Try our only takes pound coins. Are you coming in? No, you can't. Okay. Come. We can't. in the last 15 minutes yeah it takes so it's four pounds the washer one pound one pound for 15 minutes drying baby and toddler washroom oh, I've lost him what are you going around there for there's a chemical emptying point Chemical toilet emptying point. Just not, not more, anything more exciting than bins and taps. The bins. And water and drinking water here. General waste. Recycling. In for a sniff. So the fridge, What's, what seemed to be happening was that there was a ridge in this, in this barrel that was stopping the switch going all the way in, sort of, I could feel it sort of sticking, they pushed it in, so what they've done is they've filed the little ridge off and it now goes all, all the way in. So. It will now run on gas. Now running on gas. Yeah, so that wasn't wasn't I don't think the battery was the, the actual problem. Anyway, we're on an electric hookup so I'll put it back to that. So at least that's sorted for the new forest. Alright, you lost your chair. Lost my chair again. Yep. That's the biggest problem with this van is we can't bring three chairs. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, Pops, let's, let's sit down. You can sit on my knee. That's it, good girl. We're going to sit out in the sun. Oh. So it was quite a journey here, wasn't it? Because we uh, we had to go to the Dometic headquarters to get someone to have a look at our fridge, mm. which was in Blandford, Blandford. St. Mary. Yeah, and there was a big diversion that took us all the way up to Shaftesbury and back. So I don't think I'm going to show you all of that. That's no, because we didn't really know where we were, did we? No. We're just following these yellow diversion signs. I mean, I think it took us sort of right round in a big square. Yeah. Otherwise, we probably would have been there about an hour earlier. Yeah, we'd probably have been here an hour earlier. Yeah, we? yeah. So I mean, I've got a video to edit, so I'm just going to show you really from, what was it, the A35? A35, when we come yeah. along here. Yeah. So that's that's the instructions in the uh, caravan club yeah, book get anyway. Yeah, to the A35. So. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but uh, yeah. So we're just pleased to have a rest. I might, I might treat myself to a beer. Yeah. If that's all right. You with might. You. Yeah, I might do. <laughs> I might do. Yeah. So if you like what you see, give us a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe. Hit the notification icon, and you'll get an update. What are we planning tomorrow? Cork Castle, I think. Well, that'll be good. I think we'll head that way. Yeah, we're going to do a Swanage Railway. Um, yeah, if we can, we have to get on at somewhere called Norden. Yeah. 
which is at the other end so anyway yeah so we, we got some of the inside information about that from caravanning with the coxes so uh, yeah thank you for that uh, thanks so. for that because we know we've never been here never have been we? here before no. no no not been in this area no no so that'll be good yep so poppy's settling in <laughs> catch you later <laughs>